did I agree with what he said? No. Everybody goes, if you support him, then you must be racist because he's racist. I'm not racist, neither is Piers racist. Sharon Osbourne says she's sorry following Wednesday's heated discussion about Piers Morgan on the talk. And I think we should stop this And don't try and cry, because if anyone should be crying, it should be me. Right now, I'm talking to a woman who I believe is my friend. And I don't want anybody here to, to l watch this and say that we're attacking you for being racist. I think it's Anything? too late. I think that okay. seed's already sowed. While the women of the talk barely addressed that debate during Thursday's show. We are a TV family here. Sometimes we argue like we did yesterday and sometimes we laugh. But we are back together again today. Sharon did take to social media to apologize and further explain her point of view. The 68-year-old wrote in part, quote, to anyone of color that I offended and or to anyone that feels confused or let down by what I said, I am truly sorry. I panicked, felt blindsided, got defensive, and allowed my fear and horror of being accused of being racist take over. Sharon added that she is not perfect and is still learning and will continue to quote, learn, listen, and do better. She concluded her message writing quote, I hope we can all hold each other up with accountability, compassion, and love during this powerful time of paving the way for so much needed change. Of course, this all comes after Sharon defended Piers Morgan's decision to leave Good Morning Britain. I had a good chat with ITV and um, we agreed to disagree as well as his comments about Meghan Markle following the Duchess of Sussex's sit-down with Oprah Winfrey. I'm sorry, I don't believe a word she says, Meghan Markle. Well, that's a I wouldn't believe it if she read me a weather report. And the fact that she's fired up this, this onslaught thoughts. against our royal family, I think is contemptible. At the time, Sharon tweeted that she stands by Pierce, writing, quote, people forget that you're paid for your opinion and that you're just speaking your truth. I believe in freedom of speech. I believe in the right to uh, be allowed to have an opinion. That tweet landed Sharon in the hot seat, and during Wednesday's episode of the daytime talk show, her co-host tried to explain why people were upset. He doesn't want to understand that how uh, Megan was treated was racism. That white entitlement privilege that makes it racist upon itself. Once you say, I stand by my friend, then, then people think, well, then you must agree with what he's saying. When we kind of give passes or give space to people who are, who are, being, who are saying damaging, harmful things, what we're kind of doing is permissing it. And I think that's what people are reacting to.